guys wore him down a little bit in overtime? Oh, yeah. Uh, well, I got the puck uh, you know, on the boards. Try to try to make up a play to Swiber. And uh, I passed him. And I went to the goal. And it's just hit my stick and it was open net so it wasn't that hard to, to score from there but it's a good goal and uh, I'm very glad to do it. What's the key to uh, succeed in that over using this overtime format? Well it's a uh, we got a power, power play there four and three so it's, uh, it's uh, we, I think we did a good job before that too and uh, we handled Paco okay and uh, I think uh, that's what we had to do in overtime you had to get, get the puck in, uh, in your on your team and uh, try to sell, uh, like keep the puck in the the um, offense so soon. Yeah. You guys uh, definitely had to face a high uh, offensive team. There was about five or six guys who have over ten points this season. How are you able to stop uh, this offense from San Antonio tonight? Well, we talked about it before the game too. Uh, they're going to come hard, and uh, they have some big big bodies there in the, their team. And uh, I think we we did a good job, and the, uh, the forwards helped a lot. And uh, I think we. Stepped up it and play a good uh, defenseman game. And then uh, we uh, reiterated this, or at least had us in the uh, interview after the game. You guys had a really good second period. Uh, what do you think was the uh, the overall team feeling after that one heading into the third? I think we helped each other all the time out there, and uh, the forward helped the D, and D helped the forward, and uh, we talked a lot uh, to play simple uh, because the uh, the ice was bad too, and uh, just going north all the time and. Uh, Quick up uh, to the forwards and try to like play the puck behind the, the D and uh, uh, I think we did it very good.